Hey guys, it's me Rain here and welcome back to another Arsenal video. Yes, Arsenal. Another Arsenal video after for like what? Eight months? Yeah, it's been a very long time. I've been very busy. But anyways, welcome back to another Arsenal video and today we'll be reviewing the Bishop of Time bundle. Which I don't know if I pronounced that correctly. If I didn't pronounce it correctly, I am very sorry. I apologize. But anyways, um, so yeah, we'll be reviewing the um the Bishop of Time bundle. And if you don't know how to actually get the bundle, um, you have to um complete the advent calendar, which you have to log in every day. Um, oh sorry, which you have to log in every day. Which meaning December 1st to December 25th, but but the update came before December, so yeah. Anyways, um, um, but if you didn't get all the days, um, there's a little catch up thing which costs Robux. Robux, my bad, but uh, yeah, it costs 25 Robux. And yeah, so apparently uh, this is the last day, according to Yone, I think said this. Um, uh, this is the last day to catch up to get the bundle. And if you don't know what contains uh, contains the bundle, it contains a skin, a melee, a kill effect, a weapon skin, and a calling card. Yes. Anyways. Um, so yeah, um, by the time you're watching this video, it's probably removed because the catch-up thing will be removed tomorrow. But yeah, anyways, let's get into this. So the first thing we're going to do is um, review the Bishop of Time skin itself. <coughs> My apologies. But yeah, here it is, the Bishop of Time skin. And I honestly like this skin a lot. Considering it's actually uh, the fourth dominant skin in the game. The first one being the Seeker of Hearts. The second being the Christmas Nomad. I think that's what the the skin's called. The third being the Hollow Hunter skin, which was very rare to get. And the fourth being the Bishop of Time um skin. But honestly, this actually looks very, very cool. I like the cape and the clocks on its shoulders. Like, this is very cool. Probably my favorite dominant skin in the game. By the way, this is only the second dominant skin I have. I only have Christmas Nomad and this skin. I didn't get the Hollow Hunter. I did try to get the Hollow Hunter, but I ended up failing. Oh well. But yeah, and I also didn't knew. Um, the Seeker of Hearts was a thing since they had a Valentine's update last year, but it is what it is. I didn't really know about it. But yeah, that's it for the skin. So, uh, let's get on to, um, the mail. So, the next, um, the next, um, item we're gonna... We're gonna do is the melee itself, which is called the Swift End. Which, honestly, um, it actually reminds me of two melees. Also, don't mind, uh, my friend joining. So, yeah, um, this reminds me of two melee weapons itself in the game. Which is the kunai and the energy bringer. Actually, I think it's called energy bringer. But I don't remember. But it's like a combination with kunai and the energy bringer. So yeah, um, this looks very cool, honestly, um, but yeah, I actually don't know any other words to say about this melee, but anyways, um, let's just go for a backstab, I guess, so here's the backstab. Yeah, that's actually a pretty cool, um, backstab animation, so yeah. This is actually probably a good melee, but like, com like this just reminds me. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I'm being honest. Um, this just reminds me about the melee. 
the the kunai and the energy bringer melee combined so yeah anyways that's it for um the melee so let's get on to the next one so the next item we're gonna check out is the time i think it's called the timely i'm sorry guys <laughs> the timely demise kill effect and by the way yes i um turned kill effects on so yeah so let's check out this kill effect so we're just gonna reset ah so when you die, numbers and a clock um comes out of you. That's actually very interesting. So yeah. Pretty cool honestly. Probably probably the numbers come out of the clock and then and then the clock comes out afterwards, but I'm not really sure. <laughs> But anyways, that's it for the um, for the timely demise kill effect. So let's get on to the next item. So the next item we're gonna check out is the is is the time is money um weapon skin. And and I'll be honest with you guys, I actually don't really care about the weapon skins that much. I mean, they've only been introduced last year. Well, last year's summer update, I think. But yeah, here's the... Here's the, um... Uh, Time is Money, um, weapon skin. And it's alright. It's an alright weapon skin. So, um, yeah. I actually have no other words for this item, but... Yeah. Anyways... Um, time to get on to the very last, um, item for this bundle, and also this video. So, yeah. So, the very last item for this bundle and for this video is the Winds of Time calling card. And, just give me a second, guys. It takes, uh, it takes only, like, a few seconds to try and get to the calling card's inventory. But, yeah, apparently it's actually easier for PC. And for mobile, it is very hard. Yeah, anyway, well, for me at least. I'm not sure if any other mobile players is having this problem. But yeah, anyway, here is the Winds of Time calling card. And it says, you will be forgotten. Which, I actually like this calling card, to be honest. Very cool, and it's also a promo rarity, so yeah. Anyways, that's... That's all the items for this bundle. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to subscribe so we can get to 900 subscribers. And um, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Built an empire.